2014 F-150 3.5 EcoBoost. Rough idle, not staying running, customer complaint. It's a P-2112 and fortunately on this one, that's really the only code we had. The vehicle was operating properly before he had the issues. So this is a common code for the throttle body plate uh, being closed. So uh, we'll just connect the, the battery. And what I'll, about 50% of the time you can clean this throttle body. So I'm going to take it apart and clean it. Um, and 50% of the time after the cleaning, it'll come back with an issue. I'll just need to replace the throttle body. We'll make the change here and um, see what she does. So here's the throttle body um, cleaned. And I went one step further and opened this cover. This was, this is a looking clean, but it was very dirty in here. It was filled to the brim with oil for some reason. Let's to look and see where oil could have gotten into. Why it was filled with oil. But this is her cleaned up. And I'll put her back together and see how well she runs. Um, I'll probably also actuate, try to actuate this with the scanner. Should be able to open and close the throttle. So I'll give that a shot. And I should have done that probably um, before I removed it and cleaned it, but I know most people don't have a bi-directional scanner that can open and close this, but that one code is uh, the code for this being shut and not actuating. So here's that Ford EcoBoost 2014 throttle put back in, cleaned up, and uh, if you recall, I cleaned it up. Not only the throttle inside of here that was dirty, but I cleaned all this up in here. It was filled with oil. And uh, she's working again. I found something else interesting on this one. Let's see if you guys can see. What do I see? Look at that. So I just turned her around and uh, I was making a lot of noise and this is it right there. So kind of interesting this Ford uh, tried to save the driver with that uh, throttle code because uh, this vehicle should uh, not be on the road until I put a bolt back on or a nut back on there so I got one more piece to this uh, Ford EcoBoost P2112 with the throttle body actuator stuck closed um, it is a permanent code and unless you guys have found a way to do it I don't know how to do it it's actually um, built in that the you can't remove a permanent code through clearing it or trying to clear the memory so um, there's a couple of different ways to do it um, the vehicle can go through three monitoring cycles, I believe, three or four monitoring cycles, or one monitoring cycle where that code doesn't come up. Um, basically, um, if I clear clear the codes, the second one, after one confirmed fault-free monitoring cycle following a scan, so uh, following a clear code request. So all I need to do is one cycle, and each vehicle manufacturer kind of defines a uh, fault-free monitoring cycle differently. Uh, for Ford, for this year, uh, basically it's uh, no fault present, engine runtime more than 10 minutes, um, 25 miles per hour greater than five minutes and uh, continuous operation greater than 30 seconds so 
we'll drive this bad boy and um, that permanent code should be gone because this vehicle right now is running fine and the throttle body is working perfectly. I still haven't resolved why it's dumping a bunch of oil and why it was getting um, a bunch of oil in there. I have some suspicions but I don't know yet until I can diagnose it further. So this one looks like actually it's going to be fine with the cleaning and then if I can um, resolve why it got as dirty as it got. So I'm just going to drive her around and then that permanent coach would go away and then this one would be fixed.